There are three types of carbohydrates, monosaccharides, disaccharides and polysaccharides. Starch is a polysaccharide and has functional properties in the preparation and processing of food. Starch is found in grains like rice and vegetables like potatoes. Starch is made up of two substances, amylose and amylopectin. The ratio of these two substances is very important when preparing foods. Most starches contain 25% of amylose, but some can be as high as 50%. Foods with these higher proportions of amylose are used to produce foods that are semi-solid and opaque gels. Starch can thicken liquids with the presence of heat. This process is called gelatinization. And happens regardless of type of starch. But the physical qualities of the gels depend on the ratio of amylose to amylopectin. Plain flour, corn flour and arrowroot are the most common ingredients used to thicken liquids. They all have different ratios, just like proteins. The functional properties of carbohydrates are also affected by the following factors. Temperature, agitation and pH levels. Dextronization of starches. The browning of starch. IT involves the process of starch breaking down into dextrins. If the starch continues to break down, they become maltose then glucose. And as with proteins these changes occur with the addition of heat, acids and certain enzymes. See you in class for a deeper look at the functional properties of carbohydrates. MrLightfoot.com Get ahead.